Hey everyone, welcome to a special episode of Huni and Autofocus. I'm Lewis, and today I'm actually at the Freedom Factory. If you guys don't know about the Freedom Factory, it's uh, Cletus McFarland's racetrack that he recently purchased a few months back. There's a huge event here happening. They're calling it the uh, Burnout Rivals event. It's going to be hosting, obviously, Cletus McFarlane and friends, which include Adam LZ, Taylor Ray, and of course, Von Gittin Jr. and Chelsea Denofa, among other drivers as well. So I'm here with the team shooting some photos, and I'm going to be giving you guys kind of a behind-the-scenes look of the event, really. I mean, at least from my perspective, on the photo end of things. So pretty excited don't really know the exact details of how everything's gonna be playing out so it's gonna be kind of like a running gun type of thing but it should be pretty interesting let's see look at that look at that gold look at that I can literally see myself first thing that we're doing right now or first thing that I'm doing right now is um, shooting the uh, team photos for the RTR team. Um, this is basically the first official event that the RTR team is, uh, I guess, competing in, even though it's just Vaughn and Chelsea competing against each other. This is basically the first official event of 2020, gathering some team shots for the social team to use before everything gets bashed up and dirty. Let's get to it. How's that? That was beautiful. What you got? Chrome just pops. It's amazing. 7 24 to 70. Oh, dude. It's amazing. The level camera. Look at this. Chrome! Woo! So, we're finishing up with Chelsea's car, uh, and then we're gonna grab Vaughn's car. Same shots, basically, but different I guess we'll see it's pretty up so far it's really it's really hot like really really hot we're heading to shoot Vaughn's car right now and uh, he's right behind me right there can't really see it's pretty cool though I'm going like 16 miles an hour and he's right behind me look at that <laughs> it's a little scary I'm on a scooter one-handed so can't really do that it's, it's it. Got yeah, this like weave. If there's any other quick things I need to do, but that was first up. Get that too. It's like it's got like some vaporwave vibes, you know? What? Vaporwave, like yeah. with this with this like scheme right over here where it says Ford. just finished up shooting some beauty shots of the competition cars uh, right in front of the Freedom Factory. Um, I'm gonna go hydrate because it's about a million and a half degrees out now, right now. I can't even, can't even talk. Um, so yeah, move on to the next shoot. So we are about midway through the first day of shooting. It's Friday and uh, it's really kind of just like a setup day, a media gathering day really. But I kind of want to run you guys through what we have here. So this is uh, Chelsea's pro car. 
that over there is Vaughn's Pro Car. That's their iconic Penzo car, the demo car. It's basically stock uh, Spec 5D, I think. Or no, Spec 5, sorry. So I've never actually seen all the RTR Mustangs together. This is actually the first time. So right here is the uh, Fox body that you guys have probably seen videos of. And uh, this car is actually a uh, demo car. It's identical cosmetically to Vaughn's car, the pro car, but uh, everything underneath is a little different. Um, that's Chelsea's demo car. Same thing cosmetically, it's about identical to his car. This is the one that he did uh, 155 at a VIR. Pretty dope. The wheels are also like way bigger too. These look like 19s or 20s compared to the 18s that they run. Pretty gnarly. These things were kind of making a comeback. I feel like once Ken reveals his Puna Fox or you know whatever the name it's gonna end up being called, once he reveals that, this thing is gonna skyrocket in price. About to go live on the show. It's almost six o'clock, so they're about to roll the national anthem. Uh, we're gonna start the show off with the uh, best of three drift battle between Von Gin and Chelsea Denofa. They're uh, right, right over there, uh, somewhere around there. So uh, I'm shooting from the middle over here. I have my uh, 35, 135, and the 400. So we're gonna see how it's gonna go. Directly after that, they're gonna have a freestyle drift competition. So, and, and it's literally just Marine. people 
drifting around, really. Uh, Adam LZ is here, Taylor, Taylor Ray is here, a bunch of other guys are here. And then after that, they're gonna do the burnout competition, which is right over there. There's a little little burnout box, kind of similar to the uh, Burnout Bash style. So it should be really exciting. Um, I'm gonna do my best to photograph the hell out of it. I have a couple really large memory cards, so hopefully I can get yeah, 10,000 photos by the end of the night. Hopefully. Okay. to my second spot. Uh, I'm gonna go outside of the course. It's kind of a walk, but it'll be cool because they're gonna run this bank. Right over there by the scoreboard is when they get really high on the bank. You can see from the tire marks. I'm gonna go on the other side of that. Hopefully it looks really cool. I'm, I mean, I'm sure it will. Go check it out. gonna win they are both really rowdy drivers so I guess we will see but I'm gonna head to my third spot all right so I made it to my third and final spot for the uh, Bond versus Chelsea best of three drift battle it's uh the tracks turn three coincidentally um, so this is where they come up and run the final bank you can see the line that they're running so yeah pretty cool Right here with Russo. Sweat my head. Oh, oh great. Yeah. What do you think? Okay, so I definitely think Chelsea has advantage because I saw Bond not finish that one run. Yeah, first run, first run he knocked himself out by spinning, but it is a fan vote, so I guess we'll see. Ooh. You know, it's hard to call from now, but yeah, we'll see. Yeah. All I know is that it's gonna look really freaking cool. That's about I can't it. wait to see what the fans vote. I really oh, right. I'm like it, I literally don't even know which way it'll go either. It could be a total 50-50 event, you know, and I, I won't even know what's gonna happen. How about it one more time? One more game. <laughs>
I think Chelsea won that one. They're going to continue on with the uh, freestyle drift challenge. Basically, like I said, it's freestyle drift. You just run it how you like it, and uh, best line wins, really. Um, so Cletus is lined up in the C5 right now. Right over there. You can shoot some of the action, and then we'll go from there. He's suited up, so it's, it's like super serial right now. He's got his super American helmet, too. This is totally serial. <laughs> entire big banks like both sides so that's pretty cool oh he's still running he's, he's just running in the pit area I, I don't know i just didn't see that um pretty cool not gonna lie especially for like a 6.2 liter miata like damn that's straight up
I basically teleported back to my hotel room. Burnout Rivals is finally done. Um, it was a really cool event. Currently going through some photos. I counted and I shot 6,720 something photos today. It took me a couple hours to just sort through them. So I am currently editing some photos right now. Just kind of going over some selects that I've shot of Vaughn and team. It's two in the morning actually, and I'm about halfway done with these edits. So I think I could probably hash through these and finish hopefully by three. And then tomorrow, I think I have to be up at eight or nine. Five, six hours of sleep, shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, it feels good to be shooting again. Thank you for watching. It's a little different. Alright, so thank you so much for watching. We will see you guys later. That's a wrap.